Hello everyone, my name is Anna and today we are going to learn about the descent of the Holy Spirit. The Pentecost was one of the chief feasts of the Jews. Pentecost falls on the 50th day after Passover. On the day of Pentecost, the apostles and Mother Mary were praying on the upper room of Zion. The Holy Spirit descended upon them. It appeared as tongues of fire and filled them. They were given the gift of tongues by the Holy Spirit and could speak in different languages. Many Jews were in Jerusalem for Pentecost. They all came together after hearing a loud noise. They heard the apostles speaking in their own native tongues. They were amazed that all the apostles were understood by all in the attendance. The Jews in attendance said, Are not all those who speak Galilean? How is it that we hear each of us in our own native language? This miracle amazed most who heard them, but others mocked them, saying they were drunk on wine. Peter stood up and preached, These men are not drunk as you suppose. Jesus of Nazareth, who you crucified and killed, is raised to life. The risen Christ has sent to us the Holy Spirit. It is the action of this Holy Spirit you see and hear. The Jews asked, What shall we do? Peter replied, Repent and be baptized, every one of you, in the name of Jesus Christ, for the forgiveness of sins. You shall receive the gifts of the Holy Spirit. On that day, 3,000 people were baptized and joined the apostles. The church came into existence with the descending of the Holy Spirit. The Holy Spirit is God, proceeding from the Father. It is the Holy Spirit who continues the mission of Jesus through the church. The Holy Spirit will pour forth the divine grace on us, fill us continuously with love of God. Let us always pray for the grace of the Holy Spirit. Let us pray. Praise to you, God the Holy Spirit, who sanctifies us and leads us. Let us sing. Let us do this after Sunday school is done. I shall pray daily for the grace of the Holy Spirit. Let us memorize this Bible verse. You will receive power when the Holy Spirit has come upon you. This is the end of lesson 15. Let's answer some questions and do an activity to see what you have learned. How many days after Passover was Pentecost celebrated? What were the changes affected in the apostles after receiving the Holy Spirit? What did Peter say to the people on Pentecost Day? Who continues the mission of Jesus Christ in the church? Go to the next slide for answers. In the box below, list ways you can receive the Holy Spirit. All right, third grade, that is the end of this lesson. Sunday school is done for today. See you next week. Get ready for the next lesson.